Hello everyone, welcome back. Uh, the harness is just about done. We're just going to um, cover it in split loom. It's like a plastic corrugated protective covering. That way uh, when it gets installed it won't get uh, torn up. Also it's just a good protection for it. So let's get started. So here's the harness. We've got the ECU connection, the relays, and the battery connection. The diagnostic connectors, our OBD2 connector, our uh, extra wiring for uh, miscellaneous items that we covered in another video. We have our um, grommet, the large engine grommet. We're splitting the harness into two legs. We've got the ones that go will go to the top and side of the transmission. And we have the ones that are going to the engine connectors and inside the left of the engine bay. So igniter, math, pressure sensors. And we have our split loom. This is the big stuff. Um, one inch. I like it a lot. You can get it at Home Depot. It's like three bucks for this entire thing. So I pushed the engine grommet up as far as I could, as close to the computer as I could. I'm going to start right here and get the grommet over the top of it and kind of work the split loom out so that it can cover up until, you know, as far as we can onto the computer. Alright, so I put a little bit of tape over to help it ease it through the hole here. And now I'm just going to start feeding it in so that we can get another foot or so beyond the grommet. Uh, enough to get pretty close on the uh, the computer here so now I'm just gonna start wrapping the main leg of the harness so now we have the main harness wrapped and on the end here I'm just gonna use some smaller wire loom for any exposed wire that we have in all these locations all right so now we have all of the uh, exposed wiring um, roughly covered in smaller split loom. Now I'm just going to tape the joints like right in here. The uh, trick is to kind of overlap them a little bit, kind of like that, and then just kind of tape around this way, then around this way, then around this way, and until it's a pretty solid connection. And uh, you know, I'll be doing the same with all of these joints and at the ends too. Just throw a little tape on there as well. The uh, harness pretty well taped. All the joints are taped up now. And um, we're ready to coil it up and get some labels on it. So I'm going to label these relays. I'm just going to try and throw a label on everything that I can. All the, all the loose ends that need to be uh, connected up. Everything is now labeled. So... Um, this portion of the harness is ready to be boxed up. The next thing that we're going to take a look at is the alternator harness. So uh, we're going to look at that in the next video. We'll see you then.